Hi, this is Barik and in this tutorial, I will be showing you how we can create quickly an, an airplane like figure using Inkscape. So uh, let's select this Bezier card tool and with this option selected regular Bezier path. Let's click on our initial point. If you haven't used a Bezier card tool before, this is how it works. You click on an initial point and then on another point you just click and press the mouse button and then drag it to get a desired shape and then leave it and then click on another point and you click on the initial point to make the path complete now i will be using this edit paths by node and adjust it here and a bit here so that my top vertex and lower vertex comes on the same line now let's use this select tool let's press ctrl d to duplicate it flip it we have two of them now let's place them side by side okay now we have this align and distribute tool if you haven't have it here go to this object menu and here you have align and distribute okay let's select both of them and center on horizontal axis now here we have two objects i want them to be one so i want them a union of them we have this union tool using control pressing control and you press plus plus so we have this one uh, okay don't mind this middle line uh, that won't be an issue for us so let's make it a little longer now let's let's uh, make the wings we will again select the bezier path and now we will be selecting this option create a sequence of straight line segments and we will be making the wings for it let's zoom in a bit and from this point to this point maybe and here we have our lower wing let's make it a little bigger let's position it with our keyboard keys keyboard arrow keys or the mouse whatever you like and then duplicate it flip it position it okay now let's again make a duplicate and then let's place it here an upper wing let's make it a little bigger and same way duplicate flip now i want them to be on same horizontal axis so select them both click this center on horizontal axis select them both center on horizontal axis now i want them colored so we have here fill and stroke if you haven't have this here it is here in the object menu here you go fill and stroke now fill it with red color maybe and let's get rid of that stroke line okay or let's make that stroke line of the same color here also again we have this problem so let's make this a little here and if we can do it like this select the nodes and here we have join selected nodes 
join selected nodes so okay anyway it's looking fine from here okay let the wings be of blue color not stroke fill blue 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 and this also fill 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 now i want them to be go below the, the this body of this aeroplane let's get rid of the stroke lines stroke none stroke none stroke none and then okay uh, to send it below uh, the body we just do a page down let's select and press page down same for these things also fine now uh, let's duplicate it again let's make a smaller version of it with a fill color like that of the wing and stroke color to be same of that of the wing let's place it here to give a back wing like appearance whatever place it whatever you feel it's it should be let's make a circle and another circle i want the stroke lines so that i can see them now i want to make and I want this portion so clearly I will be taking an intersection of this room so we will go control minus minus and here we have intersection this is our cockpit of the aeroplane and if it looks nice to you fine otherwise you can place it things here and there uh, to see whatever works good for you maybe introduce a couple of more designs and let's group this all small parts together with ctrl g to make it one object let's make it a little taller and we will now be exporting it if you haven't have this export pane here you go here file and export png so I will be exporting it in my documents and give it a name plan X save and height should be let's say 200 pixel with whatever it wants to be and let's hit the export button so here we have it our plane dot plane x dot png so here we have it our nice little aeroplane waiting to be used in our game or something hope you like this tutorial if you have any question feel free to ask them below maybe i or someone else will answer it and this is my first tutorial video so i apologize for any mistake that i have made and hope to see you soon in my future videos bye